Hey there guys, Prince Marcus, and in this video I'll show you how you can easily create Trello cards from new Google Sheets spreadsheet rows. So you see right here that every time a new row is added to Google Sheets spreadsheet, Integromat will automatically create a new card in Trello. And now uh, what you need to do first is click on the link down below in the description. And when you're going to do it, you can easily sign with the Gmail, Facebook, GitHub. Uh, make.com in which you're going to sign up this amazing company that's going to help you integrate various applications and when you're going to have it uh, you're going to have uh, be right here in organization under scenarios you're going to find templates so click on the templates and on top right you want to write Trello and then let's say sheets And right see you're gonna have it and click on it and then you see right here so what you need to do is actually every time there is a new row is added to the Google Sheet spreadsheet integromat will automatically create a new card in Trello so what you have to do uh, the e template uses this example so I would recommend like doing something like this too in Trello cards and then create a new scenario from the template so what you have to do first is easily connect your spreadsheet and your Google account and then sheet name okay you can have the spreadsheet ID the sheet name and table contents headers continue and now when you're gonna have it you have to connect your Trello account that's like another thing what you can do and what you need to do is when you're gonna sign up to Trello uh, then it's going to start working pretty straightforward and pretty easy so you have to just connect both applications and you have to log in into them and in the moment when you're going to have it you're going to find them in your scenario so here i you can have your scenario and then you're going to have trello or google sheets here and trello here and it's going to look like like this on the bottom you can easily save on the bottom left you can run it once or you can schedule settings and schedule it for multiple times and that's pretty much it how you can do it so if you can have any questions guys ask me down below in the comments i'm really happy to help you and provide you some guidance and support also i would recommend like messaging to make that come customer support if you're not going to have a guidance on how we can uh, work with scenario and that's pretty much it so here you can go again to templates and find plenty of templates that you can use So yeah. Have a great day and goodbye.